we have uh, the parallel RLC circuit. We know all these three resistance, inductance and capacitance. And we know uh, supply voltage, it's root mean square value. And uh, this source has an adjustable frequency and our task is to find this current, its root mean square value, at half of the resonant frequency. So at first, the resonant frequency, we know that for this circuit resonant frequency is designated by this formula, this is 1000 radians per second, and um, the reactances of uh, these two energy storage elements are 1k. If we change this frequency from omega r to 0, 0,5 omega r, means to 500 radians per second, then obviously the uh, reactance of our coil uh, will be half of the reactance, and the reactance of our capacitor will be two times greater than the uh, reactance of the capacitor for omega sub r. Now, to find uh, this current for these values of reactances, and uh, this value of uh, input voltage, 10 volt. Uh, let us draw a phaser diagram at first. Uh, okay, these are currents and phaser diagram. This is our voltage, uh, resistor current calculated, uh, capacitor current and coil current. Now we have to add these three currents using a head to a tail addition and we will find the total current the total current which is hypotenuse of this right angled triangle and this hypotenuse its length is 18.0.3 milliamp this leg is 15 this leg is uh, 10 uh, then total I mean hypotenuse of this triangle is 18.03 million.